relationship with God. But you know, we've come to find out night after night, those hundreds, if not thousands, have responded. Maybe, you know, somebody dragged you here, told you it was a rock concert. Surprise, it's church. <laughs> but you know, I have to believe that the Spirit of God is. You realize the King and the, the, the Father that made you? His manifest presence is in this room. Amen! If it says we're two or more are gathered, he's in our midst. He's here with us. And I have to believe maybe God has been stirring some hearts. We've already preached the gospel. I don't have to preach it again. You've heard it. He paid it all for you. But you don't have to do that. If you haven't yet, is respond to the gospel. Yes! Somebody here, even if it was one, hasn't said yes to Jesus. You've been hearing about this amazing God who loves you, who paid you, literally gave his son for you. Thank you, Jesus. You're like, man, maybe tonight's the night I need to start a relationship. Y'all, I'm not talking about religion. Yeah. I'm not yeah. talking about a checklist. Yep. I'm talking Preach. about a personal relationship with the one that you yeah. God gave me just a really simple revelation. I have three boys, and they pray great. <laughs> pray for mama. Uh, go on. There is nothing on this earth I love more than my boys. And being their father, the one that made them, part. <laughs> God, I cannot imagine not having a relationship with my kids. I can't imagine that something that, they, that they've done or that happened to them or something that someone did to them or maybe even the way that they saw themselves, that, that that would keep them running away from me and hiding and not thinking that, like, I want them to bring me their mess. I want to help clean it up. I love them. Of course, I would have the best plans for their life. I want them to, to thrive and prosper and stand on my shoulders and do even greater things. You realize that's why Jesus left and why he gave us his spirit. He said, even greater things you will do than I because I'm leaving and I'm sitting in my spirit. Yes! If you've been trying hard, if you've been fair, it's you can't do it in your own power. You can't yeah. do it in your own strength. But there is a power that is beyond you. When you say yes to Jesus, he fills you with the spirit. And you start to step into the immeasurably more than you could ever ask for or imagine because it's according to his power he places inside of us. Yeah. yeah. I can talk all night, but here's the <laughs> here's the simple part. This is the beauty, y'all. It's so simple. In Romans 10, it says, if you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, and if you believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, it's this simple. You know what it says? You shall be saved. There's no good enough. Yeah, thank you, Jesus. If you accept him as Lord of your life, you confess it. Boom, you're saved. And then you can start on this journey of getting to know the one that made you. And yes, he wants you to live holy and righteous. Start figuring that out tomorrow. Start figuring it out tonight. Start de developing, trying to hear his voice. And young folks, you ain't got to start wearing khaki pants and a polo shirt if you start following Jesus. <laughs> yes! <laughs> so if there's someone here tonight, we just want to give you the opportunity to respond yes, to this invitation. 
Maybe like some of you, you've been running for some time. I can't think of a better night. Draw a line in the sand and go, I'm done with 70%. I'm done with 99%. I'm going all in. So there's no magic in this prayer. It's the posture of your heart. But maybe I can facilitate a quick conversation. A defining moment between you and the Lord. So, and if you've already prayed this prayer, if you're a believer, would you just pray this with me so they can hear the church around them? So just say, if you want to pray this prayer, you want to follow Jesus, just cry out, say, Jesus. 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 Here I am. Here I am. Sinner. Sinner. In need of a Savior. In need of a Savior. I believe. I believe. You are that Savior. You are that Savior. So tonight, so tonight, I want to go all in. I want to go all in. I want a relationship with you. I want a relationship with you. Forgive me of my sin. Forgive me of my sin. And make me new. And make me new. I want to be. I want to be born again. Born again. Make me. Make me a new creation. A new creation. And I want to follow you. I want to follow for the rest of my days. For the rest of my days. And I want to spend. I want to spend eternity, eternity with you, with you forever, forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and everybody says Amen. Amen.